The Benefits of Colchicine, An Essential Guide to Treating Pain and Inflammation Colchicine is a powerful drug used to treat pain and inflammation in many conditions. This essential guide will provide an overview of the benefits of using colchicine and explain how it works. With its wide range of applications, colchicine can be used to treat a variety of medical conditions, including gout, psoriasis, and inflammatory bowel disease. It is a safe and effective medication that can help reduce pain and inflammation, as well as prevent further damage. Additionally, colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. This guide will provide an in-depth look at the benefits of using colchicine, as well as the potential side effects that may be associated with its use. What is colchicine? Colchicine is a medication derived from the autumn crocus plant, also known as colchicum autumnale. It has been used for centuries to treat a variety of medical conditions, including gout, psoriasis, and inflammatory bowel disease. It works by decreasing the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, which are responsible for causing pain and inflammation. Additionally, colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. Colchicine is available in both oral and injectable forms and is usually taken once or twice daily. It is important to take colchicine as prescribed by your doctor and be aware of any potential side effects. The Benefits of Colchicine Colchicine is a powerful drug that can be used to treat a variety of medical conditions. It is an anti-inflammatory medication that works by decreasing the production of prostaglandins. This reduces pain and inflammation, as well as preventing further damage. Additionally, colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. Colchicine is most commonly used to treat gout, which is a type of arthritis caused by the buildup of uric acid. By decreasing the production of prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with gout. Additionally, it can help to prevent future attacks of gout. Colchicine can also be used to treat psoriasis, which is an inflammatory skin condition. By decreasing the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with psoriasis. Additionally, it can help to reduce the risk of future flares. Finally, colchicine can be used to treat inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. By decreasing the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with IBD. Additionally, it can help to reduce the risk of future flares. How does colchicine work? Colchicine works by inhibiting the production of prostaglandins, which are responsible for causing pain and inflammation. It works by blocking an enzyme called cyclooxygenase, which is responsible for the production of prostaglandins. By blocking this enzyme, colchicine can reduce the production of prostaglandins, which reduces pain and inflammation. Additionally, colchicine can help to reduce the risk of future flares of gout, psoriasis, and IBD. By inhibiting the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can help to prevent further damage and reduce the risk of future flares. Common Conditions Treated with Colchicine Colchicine can be used to treat a variety of medical conditions, including gout, psoriasis, and inflammatory bowel disease. It is an effective and safe medication that can help reduce pain and inflammation, as well as prevent further damage. Additionally, colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. Gout is a type of arthritis caused by the buildup of uric acid in the bloodstream. By decreasing the production of prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with gout. Additionally, it can help to prevent future attacks of gout. Psoriasis is an inflammatory skin condition that can cause red, scaly patches on the skin. By decreasing the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with psoriasis. Additionally, it can help to reduce the risk of future flares. Finally, colchicine can be used to treat inflammatory bowel disease, IBD, such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis. By decreasing the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce the pain and inflammation associated with IBD. Additionally, it can help to reduce the risk of future flares. The Risk Factors of Colchicine Although colchicine is a safe and effective medication, there are some potential side effects that may be associated with its use. The most common side effects are nausea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Additionally, colchicine can cause anemia and low white blood cell count. In rare cases, colchicine can cause more serious side effects, such as liver damage, kidney damage, and bone marrow suppression. It is important to be aware of the potential side effects before taking colchicine and to contact your doctor if you experience any of these symptoms. 
Additionally, colchicine can interact with other medications, so it is important to tell your doctor about any medications you are taking before starting colchicine. Side Effects of Colchicine The most common side effects of colchicine are nausea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Additionally, colchicine can cause anemia and low white blood cell count. In rare cases, colchicine can cause more serious side effects, such as liver damage, kidney damage, and bone marrow suppression. It is important to be aware of the potential side effects before taking colchicine and to contact your doctor if you experience any of these symptoms. Additionally, it is important to tell your doctor about any medications you are taking before starting colchicine. How to take colchicine? It is important to take colchicine as prescribed by your doctor. Colchicine is usually taken once or twice daily and should be taken with food. Additionally, it is important to drink plenty of fluids while taking colchicine to reduce the risk of side effects. If you miss a dose of colchicine, take it as soon as you remember. If it is almost time for your next dose, skip the missed dose and take your next dose at the regular time. Alternatives to Colchicine There are several alternatives to colchicine that may be used to treat gout, psoriasis, and inflammatory bowel disease. Nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs, such as ibuprofen and naproxen can be used to reduce pain and inflammation. Corticosteroids such as prednisone can also be used to reduce inflammation. Finally, immunosuppressants such as azathioprine can be used to reduce inflammation in cases of IBD. Colchicine and Heart Health Colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. By blocking the production of inflammatory prostaglandins, colchicine can reduce inflammation, which can help to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. Additionally, colchicine can help to reduce the risk of high cholesterol and high blood pressure, which are also risk factors for heart attack and stroke. Conclusion Colchicine is a powerful drug used to treat pain and inflammation in many conditions. It is an effective and safe medication that can help reduce pain and inflammation, as well as prevent further damage. Additionally, colchicine has been found to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. This guide has provided an overview of the benefits of using colchicine, as well as the potential side effects that may be associated with its use. Additionally, it has provided information on how to take colchicine and alternatives to colchicine that may be used to treat gout, psoriasis, and inflammatory bowel disease. Finally, it has discussed how colchicine can help to reduce the risk of heart attack and stroke. If you are considering using colchicine to treat a medical condition, it is important to talk to your doctor to discuss the potential risks and benefits. Additionally, it is important to be aware of the potential side effects and to take colchicine as prescribed. Thanks for watching.